Yo, what's going on, man? It's Jason Capital here. Just left the gym. Wanted to record a quick one for you. Oh, we got the, the sunglasses. Mark. Watch this. Now they're gone. So here's what I want to talk about. Anyways, what does Michael Jordan know that you don't? What does Michael Jordan know that all the other guys in the NBA who tried to succeed at the level he did but never did? What did he have? What did he know that they didn't? Or better yet, all the people that you see successful, that you admire, that you want to be like, is there something they're doing or knowing that you don't? There's this... Great biography about Michael Jordan by Ronald Lazenby. I think it's called Michael Jordan, The Life. You should read it. It's a great book. But <clears throat> I used to train basketball players, and I used to train a couple of guys who got to play in the NBA for a little bit with Michael. And they both said, not in this exact way, I'm going to paraphrase, but they both said that if you spent just a couple hours, not even a day, just a couple hours with Michael Jordan, you would no longer question why he was so successful because he was the most competitive person that they'd ever played against. And not just competitive, but his work ethic took a shit on everyone else. And it wasn't even close. Here's a quick story about Michael Jordan. He would, during the summer, here's what he did. He'd work out 5 a.m. in the morning, 5 to 7. Then he'd go play golf. Then he'd come back to the gym and he'd do another workout. Then he'd go play golf again. And then he would come back for a third workout in the afternoon, or excuse me, early evening. And then he'd go home and he would repeat and repeat and repeat every day leading up to training camp. Okay, it's like Jim Rohn always talks about. Like if you follow a really wealthy person around for a few days, you're not going to wonder why they're so wealthy anymore. You're going to be like, God damn, that person never stops. They're always doing something. And that's sort of the point. That's exactly what they know that most people who, who only tune into mainstream media and bullshit social media and and news and things like that, that they would never get that they would never know that because they're never exposed to it right and I'm not saying that those those outlets don't want you to be successful I'm implying it I'm not saying it but they certainly aren't helping anyone become successful and certainly not at the level that Michael Jordan did all right so keep that in mind today and one thing I want to point out before I forget we just made tickets available to the High Status Summit for the first time this year. We just made it available, and for the next 48 hours, they are on the lowest price that we are ever going to be offer offering them. So click the link below this video to learn more about it. I shot a short five minute video, gives you all the details about it, and if you get and secure your seat for the High Status Summit, it's a few months ahead, but if you secure it in these next 48 hours, not only are you gonna save a ton of money on your ticket, but you're gonna guarantee your place, um, and then there's all these different preferred bonuses, special speaker sessions, preferred seating, all kinds of extra bonuses, goodies, and incentives, and rewards that you get for taking action early and being one of the first to register for the High Status Summit. And you know I'm pulling out all the stops. It's gonna be our biggest event of the year for Team Capital and it is all about breakthroughs for you. Income, lifestyle, health, wealth, love, and status. Breakthroughs in 2017 for you. So don't miss this event. Click the link below, learn more about it, and have a wonderful day. Remember, Michael fucking Jordan, as you do your thing today and dominate your path. Peace.